much. They're close friends. I've been very, very excited to see this. Get your hands together right now. Start making noise right now. Start making noise for the amazing Hannah Belmont and Harry Meredith. <laughs> Who's going first? I am. Okay. Hannah's going first. It's going to be seven jokes each. Everybody, one, two, three. Rose. All right, you guys. Keep going for Brock Turner if he played lacrosse. Uh, <laughs> no, it's uh, it's cool. Harry and I are actually best friends, uh, but we're really different comedians. Like, Harry likes to joke about pedophilia, Rose, race, and his dad dying, and I get booked. <laughs> Hannah mentioned that uh, we're her best friend. She's top 50 for me, so. Um, 50 people. Um. I could rattle them off. We don't have time, folks. I coach at least 50 kids. Anyway. Uh, You're friends with kids? I lo kids love me, all right? Don't say that. Oh. Pedophilia jokes. It's what I do. It's what I do. I should just keep doing them, honestly. All right. Hannah looks like the teacher that fucks her kids, but also the kid that fucks her teachers. Yeah, I fuck. All right. Uh, <laughs> Harry does not. Uh, Harry looks like uh, before he goes down on a woman, he has to check her pH balance to make sure it won't make his tummy hurt. That's fake news. That's fake news. That's fake. Before I go down on a woman, I make sure there's a pillow underneath her abdomen, all right? And a Tom's on his bedside table. <laughs> Whatever. They taste good, regardless. <laughs> Hannah has to... All right, whoever the lady is, stop. Uh, <laughs> you're pissing me off. All right. Is that what women say when you fuck them? <laughs> Which part? Both. No, they say, keep going, you've got a hammer. Uh, <laughs> it's just true. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> all right. It's not. I do fuck, though. I do fuck. All right. Um, all right. Let's focus, guys. <laughs> what are we doing? This is so retarded. All right. All right. All right. Shh. Uh, Hannah has to carry around an inhaler with her at all times, not because she has asthma, but because she's constantly out of breath from telling everybody she's bisexual. <laughs> H Hannah's the first person to ever come out of the closet and then have her parents be like, please go back in. It was so much quieter. I tapered off. All right, no, uh, speaking of fucking, Harry is single and also his dad is dead. Uh, he's very used to being ghosted. <laughs> you guys should have seen how hot the girl I ghosted last week was. I mean... She's dead now. I would have killed her with my dick because it's so nice. All right. Well, fucking Hannah sounds... <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> oh, this is dumb. Uh, Hannah's voice sounds like when you accidentally step on a dog toy. You look like the dog whose toy it is. <laughs> All right. Which Harry looks like he skips leg day to just work on neck day. <laughs> it's not supposed to blend in like that, you know? <laughs> What the fuck? Is that how you suck dick? What's happening right now? I treat boys right, let me say that. I treat Unlike this right. prude bitch. All right. Um, <laughs> oh, man. I regret everything I've said. Uh, <laughs> Hannah's last name is Belmont, which is cool because there's a street in Chicago named Belmont. And much like uh, the street Belmont, she lets everybody walk all over her. <laughs> And if she doesn't get plowed, she's a fucking nightmare to deal with. <laughs> Speaking of getting plowed, uh, Harry reminds me a lot of an erect penis. He's, Thank he's you. bony, veiny, and women get upset when they see him on the red line. <laughs> Again, fake news. They want to fuck me so bad. It's, it's actually... I can't keep them off me. All right. Look, guys, if I wore as much makeup as Hannah, I would also look like a woman. You need, you need it to cover that razor rash. You don't even have facial hair. It's just there. All right. Was that your rose? Yeah. Okay. Um, it, wor it worked. 
Harry looks like he apologizes to the drywall after he punches through it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's funny. All right. Hannah's probably the only person that a golden retriever could walk by and think, at least I'm not that retarded. <laughs> Last joke. Harry plays lacrosse. Uh, he also has a dog. He named the dog Duke after his favorite team because they em amplify his two true passions, sports and unconscious rapeable women. <laughs> Look, I, they made an ESPN 30 for 30. It's called Fantastic Lies. Go home, watch it. They're innocent. I'm just saying. That's just 100% true. All right. <laughs> what? I'm just defending myself, honestly. All right. <laughs> All right. This one's kind of a mouthful. I regret saying that because you could have made fun of me for sucking cock, but all right. You did. Hannah is a bisexual Jew with social anxiety that's never been with a woman, never had a bat mitzvah, and never stops talking. The only thing faker than her act is her eyelashes, nails, and friendship with every male comic over the age of 40. That's, that's not true. Ask your mom. Uh. My mom. Ooh, give it up for them, everybody. <laughs> Whoa. 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 That was awesome, dude. Give it up for them. That was fucking very funny. Holy shit. Nah, good job. That was good. That felt like a brother and sister trying to get their parents divorced. You're a slut. No, you're a bigger slut, but for small children. <laughs> I liked that battle. I want to get first thoughts from Emma. What the fuck happened up here? God, it's, it's so great to watch two children be mean to each other on stage. This is so fun, so fun. Do you have a hammer? I gotta know. <laughs> not, he doesn't. Just, just for the, it, it, it influences the length. My, uh... is, the length is fine, the girth is admirable. I'll say that much. <laughs> All right. Oh. Yes, it is. Yeah, dude. Your you... neck is stiffier than your dick. Well, no shit. <laughs> That'd be fucking insane. Wait, did you guys actually fuck? You seem to be an expert on the thing. Yeah, we did. You're like, actually, that's not, that's actually not how his dick looks. That's actually not how his penis actually is, though. It looks like a xenomorph. <laughs> like the mole rat from Kim Possible. God. God, this is just If we're going to go into details. Guys, this is right. worse. I'm just <laughs> Um, I, I have to, to go with, I'm going to go with Hannah, I think. I'm going to go with Hannah. Okay, yeah. Hannah gets a vote. Give it up for Hannah. Yes. Yes. I, I loved it. I love this Disney Channel original porn. <laughs> um... <laughs> I just, I can't wait for you guys to fuck again. I can see the tension. I really want it to happen. And I know you're not into each other, but you want to fuck each other while you look into mirrors at yourselves. I love it. You're so fucking hot. You guys are so fucking hot. You know it. Um, Harry, you really... <laughs> I'm sorry. Um... I, okay, no, I like I liked your, your ending joke really hit hard, but I do feel like Hannah carried it the rest of the time. The neck joke is so funny because it is huge and giant, and your head is so fucking small on top of your giant. I have a big head. What are no, you? No, you have a giant neck and an itty bitty tiny little head. I can't even realize him right now. He has a small head. <laughs> it's so funny. No. Wait, but what, dude? It's, it's not a very huge. large head. It's a very large head. Small heads. Yeah, two small heads. Um, but Hannah does want to sit on your neck. Uh, <laughs> okay, come on. Yes. I don't know who you voted for. Hannah wins. Okay, Hannah wins. Is that three? No, that's two for Hannah. It's two. We've just been roasting them longer than their actual. <laughs> oh Time. man, I so many, uh, so much to say about this. Clarify for me real quick. Which one is Hannah? Which one's Harry? I, um, <laughs> no, come on, give it up for them. First all trans battle of the night. Come on. Two trans comedians, two for one on the surgery. That's very great. Uh, it was super close. Uh, we had a lot of close battles tonight. It was very close. Uh, goes to Harry for two reasons. Uh, one, uh, uh, he said retard twice, and that's a fun word, so we'll give it to him. 
Um, and two, the Belmont joke was really funny, so give it to Harry. Okay, Harry gets a vote. Give it up for him. Yes. Okay. Oscar. This is the whitest shit I ever seen in my life, man. I swear, I don't understand. Have the words they say. All right. Uh, the boy's wearing blue. The girl is wearing pink. <laughs> that makes sense. Hey, hey, hey! Wait your turn. You're getting the mic next. All right. Um, I think it was pretty tight, pretty even. Um, I'm gonna have to give it to Harry for the ad libs. Okay. Give it to Harry. Harry's ad libs. Leaves it tied. Tiebreaker, Kevin Kellum. Wow, this is... I, 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 don't, I don't know what's bigger than Harry's dick, but it's probably Belmont's opinion of herself uh, based on how she was going. Yeah, you're, you're trying to get casted in the Gen Z Mean Girls reboot. We know what you're going for, Regina George. Yeah, yeah, no cargo in those pants. Good for you. Um, uh, I liked it. You guys are going back and forth, neck and neck. It was very, very close, but that... That Belmont Avenue joke fucking got me. That's where that's where like it went over the edge. I'm going with Harry. I think I think Harry got you. Harry head. wins the battle. Give it up for him. Both of these two get out of here. Great job. That was fucking awesome. Oh my goodness gracious. Did you what are you? What what a, what a charismatically awkward individual. That. He was like, I fuck it, but also my dick's big. But, um, hard. Um, that was great. All right.